Hello Virgo, this is Gypsy Spirit here with you and I am ready to give you your tarot reading for uh, the week of February 12th through 18th. And um, if you'd like to have your own personal reading, you can do that. Please keep in mind this is a general reading. So some of it may apply to you and some of it may not. But if you want your own personal reading, um, I'll get into that at the end of this video. Let's go ahead and get started. I've already got your cards. We got a Six of Cups. Which means that you're kind of spending some time going back into some nostalgic times, remembering things, family things, uh, things of uh, uh, family, things of um, <laughs> memories of family memories. Um, and so when I see the cups, the cups is always uh, about emotions where your emotions are at, healing, spirituality, that sort of thing. So with this, I feel like you're just kind of spending some time. Uh, there may be some sort of a family reunion or family, something going on within the family uh, that's kind of taking you back uh, to, to a time, maybe a happy time um, <clears throat> that you're thinking about. We have the Two of Swords here. We got some swords. So whatever's going on with you, Virgo, I think it has something to do with family um, because of the Six of Cups here. Again, this is like going back, nostalgic, uh, things of nostalgia. But the Two of Swords in reverse, you're having a really hard time making a decision about something. Uh, for some of you, I feel like it's a divorce. A divorce or, or breakup. Uh, is coming to my mind. Some of you may be thinking about, um, you know, the the family traditions that you've had in, in your marriage and the good times that you've had and, and like where things are going now, it, um, having to make a tough decision and a divorce. Also, something just came to me for some of you. It may be about having to, to give up something in your family, such as having to sell your house or having to give up a family business or something uh, to do with having to give something up is what I'm feeling. And you've been spending some time uh, just kind of going back and remembering things, how things once were and why they can't be like they, they were, you know, and trying to adjust to the changes, having a really hard time making a decision. Uh, and moving on. And, you know, I, f I see also the Knight of, of, of Swords here. And this is also in reverse. This is telling me that um, you, you, you just have this uh, restless, it's, it's like almost like you're restless and you're just ready to move on and you're, you're ready to just like aggressively move forward and cut through this situation. Uh, when I see the Knight of Swords, it tells me either if it's, if it's upright or in reverse, I always feel like I need to warn you to uh, take things slowly. Don't jump on something. Um, think about the course of action that you want to take. Sleep on it even. Don't just go after something aggressively or, or try to fix something aggressively. Uh, you got to do it um, in the way that's going to be best for you and the people around you. So I, in this, I feel like you really need to just kind of sit back and you need to make a decision about something. But uh, be careful in how you go about um, moving forward and, and taking care of this conflict. But um, I just, yeah, there's like a lot going on. And I think a lot of it um, is going on with a lot of uh, families. You know, um, I can tell you that my uh, family member has, a couple of my family members have passed away in the past month. Um, and it has just really, you know, made me go back and appreciate, you know, what I had with them that it's made me appreciate my cousins. So I think, I believe, um, Virgo, in looking at this, not only 
are you going through this transition you are going through a transition of some kind and it does have something to do with family uh, or, or your past but you also have to realize that as you're going back and looking at the memories and remembering the happy times your emotions are all twisted here and trying hard to make a decision here with the two of swords um, you know we don't appreciate things until sometimes it's too late you know um, I realize how important my cousins were to me um, I never realized it until two of them passed away this past month and I realized how important my family was to me there was some other things going on in my family as well um, so you know it, it's like now you're looking back at it and you're wishing that you could go back to that time because you really do appreciate the people or whatever it was that you're going back to you appreciate it and you would love to go back there but also remember that those were memories and good things that happened, but we had to learn a lot of lessons and get to where we're at and go through a lot of things. And so now you got to make a decision. And it, it, it's almost like you're at a stalemate. It's like you're damned if you do and you're damned if you don't, but just make the decision and know that whatever the outcome is, um, there's no right or wrong decision you know if there's there's two ways that you can go if you go one way then it's going to open a door for more new opportunities if you go another way it may not have been the best way but it just means that you weren't ready to move as forward yeah, there was there's still more lessons to learn i hope that makes sense to you and the knight of swords again think it through don't just jump and, and run into something or solve something uh, aggressively. You gotta make a decision and then once you make the decision, whatever it is you need to make that decision on, uh, again, this is general reading, so you pick your story. So whatever it is that you're having to decide on, once you decide, you're gonna move forward. But once you start moving forward, take it slow, take it a little easy and, and um, think it through and you're going to be okay. So Virgo, if you'd like to have your own personal reading, you can get that uh, with me. All you have to do is go to the box below and it has my website there. You can go to the website and learn how to get your own personal reading over the phone with me. If you'd like to get a personal reading with me every month, you can become a, a Patreon member of my Patreon page and that's also listed in the box below. If you like this video, please hit the like button. Also, if you would uh, like to get more of my um, YouTube videos, please hit the subscribe button and you'll get a notice every time something comes out. If you're watching the Super Bowl today, I hope your team wins and if it doesn't win, that's okay. Uh, I hope you have a really good time eating good food and hanging out with family and friends. In the meantime, have a great week and I will see you next week. Bye-bye.